We wanted to show that each one has their own has their own life and has their own story, and they are well-rounded individuals. Uh, they're just disabled, okay? And, and Woody didn't know that community, Woody's character, Marcus. He didn't know anything about that community, so he had preconceived notions that after spending time with them, he found out they were all wrong. Hey, Bobby, you- amazing job on this film. It is hilarious, inspirational, and full of heart. What was it about Champions that drew you in as a director? Well, there was an original movie. I can't. We can't take full credit because it was an original Spanish movie, Campeones, and uh, that you know the arc of the story was <clears throat> all in that movie, and we really enjoyed it. <clears throat> Excuse me. What we wanted to do, of course, is make it an American story, and Woody was the perfect guy to play the uh, basketball coach. So we just thought he's <clears throat> he he knows basketball as well as anyone. He's the right guy, and. We had so much fun. Now, I love how you give insight into each of the players' lives, whether it be their home life or their work life. Can you talk about why that was important for you to include in the film? Yeah, to show that they had to to really make them all well rounded. We didn't want to we didn't want them to just comment, oh, they're they're funny and you know they have a good you know good quips and all that. We wanted to show that each one has their own has their own life and has their own story, and they are well rounded individuals. Uh, they're just disabled, okay? And, and Woody didn't know that community, Woody's character, Marcus. He didn't know anything about that community. So he had preconceived notions that after spending time with them, he found out they were all wrong. You know, there's a scene where I got a little misty-eyed when we finally learned why Darius has a problem with Marcus. It's a really powerful scene. Uh, what inspired that story point? And can you talk to me about what those two actors brought to the table on that day? Because it was quite emotional. It was. Uh, that was a great scene. I got to give credit to Mark Rizzo, our screenwriter. He uh, he he had written that scene beautifully. Uh, but our two uh, our two actors. I knew Woody could nail his side, but the other guy, Darius, who had never acted before in his life. Uh, oh wow! Yeah, and he played this uh, this character of, a, of of someone who had suffered a brain injury, and uh, it it comes out. It was it was hidden in the story, and it, it finally reveals what his you know why he's upset with his new coach and uh he played it so beautifully he played it so real uh, everybody on the set was like wow i mean that that was some serious acting we were at the you know at the at the director's monitor watching it and we we're welling up like he he really he really moved us so tremendous acting by Darius and, and really all the 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 cast of friends, they, they all, each one stood out when they, when they had to. And that was Darius's moment there. Yeah. They were incredible. Now I also love the chemistry between Woody and uh, Caitlin Olson. Can you talk about collaborating with them uh, to find that push and pull? Yeah. The thing we wanted to capture with Woody and Caitlin is we wanted it to be real. We wanted, uh, we just wanted to feel like she's a real woman. She's a, re- you know, and, and I think she, Caitlin played it really, really well. She's a woman that, Kind of is, is held back because she's she thinks she's doing right by her brother, who, who's disabled brother. But in a way, she's not because she's she's not letting him grow and she's not giving him enough, you know, f- enough faith that he can he can be fine on his own. So she's a little overprotective and sort of holding him back. But she played it in a way that I, I thoroughly believed it. Uh, I thought Caitlin was really really good and it's, a, and it's a key part of the story because uh we wanted it to feel real you know i love that the comedy is never through the lens of making fun of the friends if anything woody's the butt of the joke i think you did an incredible job with balancing that uh and, and infusing that with heart so uh bobby thank you so much for your time incredible job on the film i absolutely loved it well thank you very much thanks yeah thanks thanks bobby